All right, y'all, here we go. Cool. Tasha good, got me hooked on this. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, here we go. Mm. Oh, oh, shit. I'm trying to tell y'all. Mm. Okay, so she says, I'm in a relationship, and every time I go to school, I keep hearing about him going both ways. He has a video, and I ask him every day, do you go both ways? That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gon' eat a little, prank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you L O L when you click play? No, this ain't no clickbait. What up y'all? Hey guys, it's Steph and Tasha and we back with another video. Before we get into the video, I wanna ask you guys to please thumb this video up if you like it. Share, comment, and subscribe. If you're new here, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If you've been here before, welcome back. Stephanie is going to tell you what we are doing today. Today, you guys, we are doing rotisserie chicken dipped in flaming Hot Cheetos. Crumbs? Crumbs. <laughs> Crumbs, okay? Yeah, with hot Cheeto sparkles. I feel like this is about to be good. Probably. You ready? Yes. Then let's get into the video. Alright guys, we're back. So, we have two whole rotisserie chickens here, you guys. I made some steamed broccoli. And you have a mix, what did you, sauteed? I have um, sauteed spinach, bok choy, and chards with some Asian flair. Okay. And then we also, as you can see, crunched up a whole bag, the large bag too. That's, that's the extra flaming. That's the whole thing? Yeah. Oh. The extra flaming hot Cheetos. Yeah. So I'm gonna be dipping that. I don't know if Tasha's really gonna do it, but I am. Okay. Nope. I'm dipping mine in barbecue sauce, y'all. Wait. I also have some ranch, y'all. So I'm gonna be doing some combos today. I'm gonna be doing some combo dipping. All right. All right. I'm ready. I see a wing falling off, so I'm just gonna grab this. I'm over here. Hung. Okay. Oh, me too. Re. I am so hungry. I ate breakfast. I had a um, oatmeal. Mm -hmm. And an egg. Mm. Ooh, it's hot. I love rotisserie too. Too hot. So I'm gonna go on and go with this, y'all. This healthy bites, okay? Mm. It's bomb. I'm gonna go ahead and give the people what they came for real quick, y'all. So I decided that it might be good to start with some lemon. So the 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 crumbs can actually stick. All right, y'all, here we go. Cool. Oh, man, I'm so excited about this. Y'all know I've been eating hot Cheetos for the last few days. Right. Tasha good got me hooked on this. She eating them more than me, I don't even eat them. Give me a thumbnail. Here we go, y'all. Mm. Mm. Good. Oh, it's hot. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. It's good. Mm -hmm. Can you taste it? Yep, sure can. Sure can. Hot Cheetos dipped rotisserie chicken, y'all. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Hey, my thing is just try it. Mmm. Mmm. You need something to. Help it stick. All right. All right, y'all. Here we go. Mm. Oh, oh, shit. Trying to tell y'all. Mm. Trying to tell mm -hmm. y'all. That's a hot mess. <laughs> mm -mm. I don't really like that. That's too much. Oh, my goodness. I don't think I can fit this in. Oh, here. that's good. Really? You're going to do that to the vegetables? Yep. Sure am. You're wrong. I'm going hot Cheetos crazy. On it. I'm going hot Cheetos crazy, y'all. Hot Cheetos. It's so good. <laughs> it is good. I ain't mm. going to lie. Mm-hmm. Okay, good too. Hot Cheetos is like B-Love sauce. Real right. good with everything. <laughs> Fuck it. Hot Cheetos carrot. Boom. No, I'm just playing. I ain't, I ain't doing it. No, another thing I want to try was uh, I want to try hot Cheetos. Right. 
and then dipped in ranch. Oh, that's probably a lot. <clears throat> a lot of goodness. Good. That's good. Y'all probably don't care about this, especially with hot Cheetos going on, but these are pickled onions. And, and carrot. With mm. lime. I need to get into this meat. Mm. Who loves rotisserie? Me. Mm. I love it. I ain't gonna lie though. I went to Germany for a little while when I was a teenager. Mm -hmm. They have the best rotisserie chicken I ever tasted in my life. Really? Never had it. Mm -hmm. I've never had it that good. That's because you ain't had meat, my rotisserie. <laughs> oh. That's why I'm just playing. <laughs> I believe you. No, but once you have the, uh, mm. the rotisserie machine, you can just do every all kind of flavors and stuff. It's so good. Mm. We'll probably tear a rotisserie up over here. It's so good. Mm. Woo! It's hot, huh? Yeah. I want to enjoy my food. <laughs> well, you always complain that it's not hot enough. That's true. It's definitely hot enough. Mm -hmm. mm. Y'all, I'm mad because I can't even. <laughs> mm. I know some people are mad at me right now. Mmm. For the hot cheeto? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. They need to be mad at that damn sauce. All right. Mm. Are you talking about your sauce? What you dipping in? Barbecue sauce. Mm. Um, we actually got this from a viewer slash family member. Because we call y'all family members once. Once, you know, y'all get up in there. I think it's Larry's. These greens are delicious. Woo! This is so good. Mm. Mm -mm. So if you guys are new here, thank you for joining us. We generally eat for a little while, talk about the food, and then we'll have a topic later. Tasha has no idea what we're talking about today. Nope. Because I found it while we were preparing and I didn't. Normally we talk a little bit about what we're going to talk about, but we just didn't have time, y'all. Got a lot going on. Yeah, I was doing some taxes. Mm-hmm. Um. Mm -mm -mm. Did you guys see our hot Cheetos fried snake mm -hmm. <laughs> video? That okay, came out yesterday, right? Out. Nah, that came out a couple days ago. Mm -hmm. Um. This ain't going out till Saturday. Oh. And share it, you guys. If you if you think it's like shareable, share it. I'm mad that you got me hooked on this. Hmm? I'm so mad that you got me hooked on this. Oh. I ain't put all kind of ranch, I mean, all kind of hot Cheetos on <laughs> chicken. Mm. I just eat the Cheeto. Mm. But the fact that you're able to fry it so good, and yeah. she made me some hot Cheeto fried prawns that mm. I did a couple days ago, y'all. Those things were so delicious. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's so good. So y'all know, once I get hooked on something, you gonna see it in a few videos until I get over it. Yep. <laughs> so I like my Cheetos in the bag. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm -hmm. This is good. Really good. You guys, this is a low calorie, low um carb meal. Well, yours. Besides that, <laughs> yours. besides this though. Yeah. <laughs> I'm messing mine up with the Cheetos, but oh well. I ain't ate shit else today. I can eat some Cheeto crumbs. <laughs> it's good too. Well, how do I eat a whole side of chicken already? <laughs> I did I too. Feel greedy as heck. I almost did too. We should have made this a challenge. Mm-hmm. That's what I said. Mm -hmm. Who likes the neck bone? I love the neck bone. My dad always um bakes chicken. And when I used to live there, I used to go in there. As soon as he pulled it out the oven, and pull out the neck bone. Really? Before anybody else could get it. Uh huh. I love neck bone. I never ate the neck bone. Mm -hmm. You know how this one? 
Theirs ain't as good as my dad. My dad would just fall off. Mm. What's our topic? So our topic is from a viewer. Thank you to everybody who um, hits us up on Facebook and Instagram for and gives us viewer topics. Or if you just want to talk to us, you can also hit us up there too. We talk to a lot of people every day, y'all. So don't be mad. And we all have time. Yeah, and one thing I wanted to say, if you, I'm sorry, I don't even be letting her finish. I'm sorry. I love you though. I love you too. Um, if you gave us a topic and we said, oh, we're going to get to it. And this was months ago and we haven't got to it yet. Send us another message because we may have gotten so bogged up with messages that we forgot. Mm -hmm. So if you have a topic that we haven't discussed and it's been a while, hit us up again. Yes. Because so many people um, dealing with you guys that your thing will get pushed so far down uh -huh. that when we get ready to look for topics, we can't find it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, yeah. Anyway, so today we are going to discuss a topic from a young, concerned lady very concerned i was kind of talking to her on facebook about it because she she left a brief message but i wanted to get some more information <clears throat> so i'm just gonna tell you what she said at first brace yourself y'all i'm about to brace myself because okay so she says i'm in a relationship and every time i go to school i keep hearing about him going both ways he has a video and i ask him every day do you go both ways he just keeps lying, and I just want him to start telling the truth. What should I do? So my first question was, what kind of video? Yeah, yeah. that's what I was wondering. I was like, a video? I didn't want to assume anything. So I asked her, what kind of video? She said, video of him <clears throat> and compromising sucking on long meat. No. <laughs> yeah. Video? to say that. <laughs> video and him uh, compromising the situation with another man. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. And it, now she says videos as well. So I don't know if he's a star, uh, that type of movie star, or he's just doing videos or Snapchatting and shit. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm not sure if it's like amateur stuff or what. Okay. Okay. So I said, okay. So what? I mean, is he denying that he is him or what? I mean, if you see the video, she said, yeah, he's denying that it's him, although I can see his face. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Okay. So then my next question was, do you have a problem dating a bisexual man? Because it's going to be two different things. You know, if you don't mind that, then you need to just talk to him. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't want to date a bisexual man, in my opinion, it's just like, move on. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? She said, I don't, I don't mind dating bisexual people. I would date him, but the fact that he's lying and not keeping it real is what's bothering her. Because if he's lying about that and it's clear in his face, then he'll damn sure lie about something that you won't care is, right. that, that you don't know about. You know, you can't really trust him if he's lying about something you can clearly see for yourself. I would say to her, if you know for a fact that it's him and he's lying to you and you know that you don't accept lying in a relationship, then you cut it off, period, point blank. No, no pussyfooting around, none of that, because that gives him uh, leeway to continue to lie to you because he's like, oh, okay, she know I'm lying mm -hmm. and or she's dumb because she believes this and it's clearly my face. He knows that you know he's just going to keep denying it. Some people are like, I'm going to lie to my grave no matter what, even if you see me. Mm -hmm. He seems like he's the one of them type of people. Um, if you care about him and like want to be friends with him still, though, maybe you could talk, break up with him, talk to him about like you need to be real with yourself or you're not going to be happy, you know? Mm -hmm. um, but I don't think that I don't think that he's for you. I don't think that he's for you. Nobody who's lying and doesn't even know themselves is ready to be in a relationship. Either he, first of all, how you gonna deny something like that, but then you all videotaping it? That seems strange to me. You're gonna what? deny it, but you videotape? I wouldn't videotape anything if I wanted to hide who I was. Exactly. So yeah. That's why I was like, is he a professional? Why is he videotaping it? Is he, was it something that he just did years ago? Yeah. For money, you know? Right. But some people will do it, you know, to make a little money. And then that's it. But is he out here still having relations with anybody else, male or female? Right. That's what I told her. You need to have more respect for yourself and your own health. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's a male or female that he's out doing stuff with. Right. If he's lying, that means you basically are you putting your whole self at, at risk. Yeah. You know? You don't even know, you know, yeah, no, nah, I wouldn't I wouldn't I wouldn't deal with him anymore. I'd end it ASAP. <laughs> you already feel it some kind of way. So mm -hmm. that's the reason why you're asking. You know you need to go and you're smart enough to, excuse me, realize that 
this ain't going nowhere. I would definitely leave him alone. It's not going nowhere. And you got video surfacing campus. That make you look crazy. Yeah. I mean, that like, that makes you look, I'm going to use the term. I would feel dumb if I was with somebody and they weren't telling me that they were doing these activities, but they're video surfacing all around campus. And I'm going, I go there every day and people know both of us. No yeah. way. No way. Yeah. Get out of that. Yeah. So he's trying to be on a DL. And right. he ain't even on the DL. That's what's strange. You on the DL, but you're not on the DL? He's probably still doing that right now. He's probably using you as a front for being straight, basically. Oh, so he may not even like women at all. He might not I like think women. a lot of guys, I mean, people, I won't say guys, people um, mm -hmm. do that to keep up a front for their family or mm -hmm. friends or colleagues, whatever the case is. Right. And they will marry you and have whole children with you and ruin your whole entire life and then tell you finally when they're 55 years old, right. when your kids are teenagers, that you know what? Mm -hmm. I don't want to do this no more. And now you're stuck having to find somebody at 60 and 70 years old, which is fine. You can still find someone, but dang, I, I wish I could have lived my young life with somebody, exactly. you know? Mm -mm. Yep. Don't even do it, girl. Let him go. Go find some There's fun. There's plenty of men in this world who only like women. Yeah. And who will be faithful to you, hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> Dang. They definitely like women. Yeah. You just doing anything with fried yeah. Cheetos, huh? I'm just not even getting on here. This is a pita. Oh, yeah. If you put it, dip it in ranch and then dip it in that. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> he said, ain't wrong. Okay. That looks good. Mm. That looks good. I'm doing too much, y'all. You are. I you gotta are. stop. You are doing too much. I gotta stop. But it looks good. I know y'all gonna be talking about me in the comments. I don't even care, though. Fuck it. Whoever wants to talk shit. You can see. I'm saying fucking I don't give a damn. I'm freaking this shit with hot Cheetos. Shit. You want some? No. Absolutely not. It looks good, though. Mm. If I was in the mood for hot Cheeto. Powder, I would. I don't even like hot Cheetos, y'all, but I love this for some reason. It doesn't That's taste true. the same. See, every time I open a bag of hot Cheetos, now I don't get them often because, yeah, y'all, I don't think hot Cheetos are the best thing for you, but a lot of stuff is not the best thing for you. Exactly. But I love them. So every time I open up a bag, she like, uh, did you fart? Like, I'm like, no, I didn't. <laughs> All right, y'all. I think Tasha's about to go to sleep. Right in front of the camera. I am. I'm definitely. I'm. I'm <laughs> chilling. I'm chilling. So if any of you guys have experienced something similar, or maybe going through the same thing right now, please leave um, some advice in the comments. Let us know what you guys think. If you want to tell us your story, go ahead and do that. What else, baby? The video is over, y'all. We're done. Love you guys. We appreciate you. Um, we keep saying that we might go live, but it's not happening, so I'm not going to say it again. <laughs> I would love to go live at some point soon. Uh, we both would, Probably actually. Um, so, if you want to know more about us, we have a vlog channel, Steph and Tasha Vlogs. The link is in the description below. Hit that. Um, put your notifications to all so you don't miss any live streams. Daily uploads or premieres. Yeah. And until next time, only good vibes. Peace. Peace.